I believe that you should do this first when you're just starting a YouTube channel. What's going on guys? If this is your first time on my channel, my name is Hassan El Sadiq. I am an entrepreneur and I live in Cartagena, Colombia. Uh, I just wanted to go through something real fast because if you're starting a YouTube channel, I think you should do this. People will tell you to pick a niche, pick something that is one thing and run with that. Um, people will, will tell you to make entertaining videos and be this person on camera, right? Um, I believe differently. I don't believe that you should pick, pick a niche. I believe you should make your YouTube circled around you and your story. I believe you have your own currency from your story. That's what I believe and also from your interests. So if you pick one thing, let's just say, okay, we're, let's talk about me. I'm picking one thing. I'm a former professional basketball player overseas. What if I only talked about sports? I'm going to be boxed in. I believe us as people, we are so much more than that. And that's why I believe that you should do this first when you're just starting a YouTube channel so you can see your interests on a paper, on a board, and then you can kind of draw your ideas from those interests. And it doesn't keep you boxed in because if you have followed my channel, you should know that I'm making and I'm posting videos about the hero story framework, right? Where it starts with your origin story and goes through your life. And that's what you should be using as far as building yourself as a personal brand. You should be using like a hero story framework. You could use mine. Um, that would be great, but you don't have to. But you should be telling your story because your story is your currency. The only unique thing about you is your unique story, right? So you need to, um, you need to really, really take that very, very serious, right? Let's just say, okay, I'm a former basketball player or I'm a basketball player. How many basketball players is it in the world? It's millions. However, my unique journey as a basketball player is unique to me. Yes, it might be similar, but the complete journey is unique to me. That's just an example. So I just wanna go through, this is what you should do. You can do it on paper. Um, you should make a circle, right? You should make a circle like this. Ah. I, my art, I'm not an artist though, okay? So art will not be part of this. And you should put your name. I'm gonna put my name. Hassan, right? That's me. But then from there, what I'm going to do is I'm going to branch out my interests. Okay? Now, interests. Sports, okay? So my company, All Dreams, is a sports technology company. So this is going to be one of my bigger things that I'm going to be talking about because not just sports and first take and uh, reacting on what's the news, but sports in general, right? Um, for us, it's the stories of athletes, the journey of athletes or whatever. So I'll be talking about that, right? That's, that's one of my interests. So I'll definitely, that'll be part of my channel. Now, you wanna, you can even break sports down because I'm a basketball player, right? So I'll be talking about my journey as a basketball player as well throughout my channel. So that's a smaller bubble of the bigger bubble sports, right? Even here, I can talk about my startup, okay? So this is giving me ideas when I'm going out to make some type of videos or whatever. I wanna tell a story about my basketball career. Oh man, I got ideas right here. I wanna talk about my startup. Okay, how can, how can I branch ideas from this? How can I branch ideas from that, okay? This is, now this is a huge thing for me as well.
family. I have three daughters, love my mother. Uh, I often talk about my father in my videos as well. So this is a large part of what my content would be about, telling stories around my family, my daughters, right? So I'm having, I, I can get ideas from there. Um, this is a large part of my life as well. Um, business, uh, entrepreneurship, however you spell it, right? I can get ideas about that. Again, my startup comes up. Um, we can say, other businesses that I've done, right? That's all a part of that. So I have my ideas there. So now like, look, look what's happening. If you say I'm doing one niche and you say, man, I'm just a sports person, right? I think that just puts you in so much of a box. Like, why would you want to be in a box when as people, we have so much more than us than just one thing, right? And the thing about it is, when they say audience, you know, cause YouTube can help you find your audience. But guess what? It's you, it's you that people should want to come to your channel for first. Now, some of them are gonna like when you talk about sports. When you talk about your family, they're gonna get to know you more. You talk about your business, right? Oh wow, he's a business person too. He has so much more to him. Oh, you tell him about your basketball stories. Okay, that makes them closer to you, but it's you. You are the currency. You have to understand that. You are the currency, right? So here's a big one. Here's, a, here, here, here's another big one. Living outside of USA, okay? Living outside USA. Yes, right now I'm living outside USA. I live in Cartagena, Colombia. That's a big part of my life, right? I live in a barrio. I don't live in a tourist zone. I don't live in like a tourist zone. I live with among the people. So these things right here, how is that? Right? People may want to know that or whatever. They want to know different things about my life living in a barrio. That's a part of it. Now, just say I made my channel just about living outside the United States. That would just put me in such a box, such a small box, that I would never be able to get out because it's so much more to me. We can keep going. Big part of my life. Storytelling, right? Storytelling. It's a big part of my life because I'm 44 years old. I've had so many experiences up until this point playing professional basketball in Argentina, um, starting several, several businesses, being a father, a single father for uh, a large period of my, my daughter's lives, right? Um, storytelling, telling about those stories. And again, what does it all come back to? All comes back to who I am, who I am. It's my channel. This is what I'm building. I'm, I'm building this channel not just for now, but I'm building this channel thinking long game that my grandkids, my grandkids, kids will be watching this journey that I'm on. They'll be able to tune in and watch their grandfather on YouTube when I am not even alive anymore. That's the long game that you play. And if I can add enough value into the world, guess what? I'll get paid as well for telling my story, okay? Um, we can do more, right? We can do, we, 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 we can do more. I can branch this into living a healthy lifestyle. Bam, working out. What do I do when I work out? Healthy lifestyle, diet, right? Diet. I can talk about my diet, what I eat. Um, that's part of healthy lifestyle. So this is what you should do. The very first thing you should do when you're starting a YouTube channel, you should do this because you are so much more than a niche. Cross the niche out, 
we don't want to be a niche. We want people to come to our channel because of us, right? Because of who we are and what we are becoming. Our hero story. Every single day we're building our hero story. So this is an example and I would say you should do this and maybe I'll make a document with blanks or whatever and you can just fill it in and um, maybe that will help you out. Let me know if you would want something like that because I will definitely do that. I just wanted to share that real fast, but I believe everyone that's starting a YouTube channel should do this with their self. Now you start getting ideas about videos and stories you want to tell, uh, what you know about business, and you can start really digging deep. YouTube, I believe, it's not about surface level. It's about depth, right? It's about depth. People want to know the person, who you are, um, and that's a great thing. That's a great thing. That's why people follow and subscribe to people on YouTube, and when they see them, they have conversations. You ever meet somebody um, that's been subscribed to you in person, they feel like they know you, and that's a great thing. That's a great thing. That's a great thing, as long as they're not trying to harm you or anything like that. Okay, that's the end of this video. Everybody should do this. Please, if you like this, subscribe. Um, Hero Story, part one. I'm going to link that up here somewhere. Watch that framework. That's part one. Like I said, it's five parts, and I'm going to do four more videos just like that, um, talking about building your hero story. Peace.